Rock and roll. That's up, Papa. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> island of Murano. Nestled into the northern half of the Venetian lagoon is the glass-making capital of the world. My name is Davide Salvadore e sono un maestro vetraio che lavora nell'isola di Murano. Hey. Davide Salvadore oh. is an 11th generation glassmaker here in Murano. Everybody worked, worked in the glass in my family. My father, my uncle, everybody. My family worked the glass since 1630, 1650. Starting as an apprentice six decades ago, Davide first learned to work with glass from his grandfather. Povero così. Today, he's a maestro, a master glassmaker. I was uh, 17. I was called Maestrino. I make a uh, simple piece, beard, uh, fish, uh, gondola, you know. Nearly all glass blowers here have to cut their teeth on the tourist trade. But Davide has taken his skills to the highest level and creates breathtaking sculptures in glass. After 60 years at work, I want to do only what I like to do. <laughs> it's a family business. Glass runs in their veins. The 12th generation now works alongside their father. We had uh, a certain uh, friendship, okay? So we are living together, uh, doing the same steps uh, together. So it's uh, something difficult to, to, to explain, but in the same time, uh, <laughs> for sure is uh, my father, but in the same time, I think uh, one of the best maestro that you can find out. Is the best uh, uh, introduction in glass, so I'm super lucky on that. I love it. <laughs> Io amo lui. Today's creation is something only a maestro could envision. The sculpture is inspired by a photograph Davide saw many years ago. I saw a picture about an uh, African woman, she takes the, the water and she has the, the vase on her head and this movement captures my imagination. What do you find at the intro? He'll use multiple types, textures and colors of glass to create his own vision of that image. For the next two hours, he and his team will work non-stop they'll each make a part of the larger sculpture, then put it together to form a single piece. The glass becomes too hard if it cools, so it must stay in constant motion to retain its shape and yeah. kept hot, typically between 1,000 and nearly 1,400 degrees. Praticamente adesso ognuno di noi sta preparando una parte del pezzo. Dopo andremo ad attaccare a unire tutto insieme. As the base of the piece starts to take shape, teamwork is everything. A 
glassmaker's workshop is loud. Verbal cues would leave you hoarse by the end of the day. So they plan as much as they can in advance and use clanks and bangs to let each other know what they want. Of course, the maestro is the maestro, ma if you don't have the assistant already for you, it's a disaster. With my son, I, I don't need you to talk. They know what I want. I show him, or just because they know what I want to do. Adesso sto sistemando la bocca per poterli attaccare assieme. separate pieces of glass now shaped, yeah. Davide is ready to put them together. He uses a historic technique called incalmo. In the Venetian dialect, this means graft. Hey! Rock and roll! The openings of the two pieces must line up precisely. Otherwise, they won't join properly. Glass doesn't give you time, so every step, everything, every movement have to do in the right moment. Centrifugal force helps stretch the glass evenly, prepping it for the last stages. Davide and Marco rely on the same techniques glassmakers in Murano have used since 1291. It doesn't make their job any easier. In, in one second can happen something bad. The glass is a, is a challenge every time, every time. In the early days of glassmaking, artisans were moved to Murano and forbidden to leave the island. Some say it was to protect Venice from the fires that burned here day and night. Others say it was to protect their secrets, which were passed from one generation to the next. Yeah, yeah. Ground. Asa. Fermo. Su pian peo. Grande. E ci appa ancora. Via. Sculpture comes together. Davide adds just enough heat to be able to shape the glass into its final form. Uno and another. Bravissimo. Bene. Bene. Via. Via. Oi. Calmo, Franco. Uh, our heart is pushing always. It's uh, something. It's something really difficult to explain. But uh, the, the the good thing is that if you have a good director, as Davide does, uh, everything is more smooth. Uh, no mistakes, no troubles, uh, no problems, and just going. Yeah. 
expertise and love these artisans have for their work is literally baked into it. This is forte. This is forte. And it pays off. Finally, the finished piece is rushed into a special oven. This will cool the sculpture slowly. Yeah. Otherwise, it will shatter, and they'd have to start all over again. Of course, I am happy because uh, it's a challenge every time. When I am finished, it's a... <sighs> Marco by his side, Davide has finished another masterwork. And someday, perhaps sooner than he imagines, Davide's son will become the master. For sure, staying close to the family. This is something that grew up inside your blood. So it's something super special, I can tell you.